today we are going to read the book called My First Soccer Game. I didn't make a video for two weeks because I was sick and then I was on a vacation. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe so I can keep making videos. Let's jump right into the book. My First Soccer Game. It is my first soccer game. I cannot wait to play. I have my ball, my cleats, and my soccer shirt too. This is going to be a great day. Yay, it's having so much fun. At soccer, I meet lots of new friends. Coach Green helps us warm up to get ready. Look, they're getting ready. This is fun. I like soccer already. It is game time. We run, dribble, and pass. Our feet start and stop the ball. Look, they're playing with a ball. Teamwork is what soccer is about. It does not matter if you are big or small. Can you see the ball? It's round in a circle with white and black. And the black is a house shape, which is a pattern. There is a big net that is called a goal. Can we kick the ball inside? You can kick the ball in the net. Ready, set, aim. Now I shoot the ball in. I did it. I am so glad I tried. Look, he kicked the ball going here, here, and there, and somebody almost got it. We shake hands with each other. We give high fives. We cheer for the other team, too. Then all of us share drinks and snacks. Graham crackers. That guy must be eating the same thing, and that other guy is drinking juice. Soccer is awesome. We want to come back. Do you want to be a soccer player? Find a grown-up to help you learn the soccer moves in this book. Don't forget, in soccer, you don't need to use your hands. You can only use it if you're a goalkeeper. These are the steps to do the warm-up in soccer. Step 1. Follow the leader. Jog or run slowly in a circle with your friends. Step two, lift your knee. Now lift one knee at a time. Can you balance on one leg like a flamingo? Step three, stretch time. Can you move your knees up and down? Like a butterfly flutters, it swings. That's a, oh, a great stretch that will get you warmed up fast. Hey, now you're ready to play. The next step is dribble, pass, and stop. Step one, steady the ball. Put the ball next to the inside of your foot. Step two, dribble. Move the ball forward, back, or even slide to slide. Oh, side to side. Tap and run, tap and run. That's called dribbling. Step three. Buddy up, pass the ball back and forth to teammate as you run. That's called passing. Be sure to practice with both feet. Step four, stop the ball, toes up high to the sky. Heel down low, way to go. That's a great way to make the soccer ball stop. Kick the ball is the next one. One. Steady the ball, steady the ball, 
with one foot. Use the inside of your foot to aim the ball. Step two, shoot. Kick the ball right in. Step three, uh-oh. Did the goalkeeper stop the ball? The goalkeepers are the only players who can use their hands. Next is teamwork. One, working as a team. Soccer is about making friends and working together as a team. Two, different teams. When you play soccer game, there are always two teams. Each team wears different color shirt. Step three, positions. Every person has a special place and position on the field. Right defender, goalie, left defender, try them all as the team, right forward, left forward, step four. After the game, be sure to have a cool drink after you play and be sure to have lots of fun. Don't forget to comment, click the like and subscribe button, and press the bell icon. Thanks for watching my video. Bye!